Let's say I believe you. I'm short on proof, so let's say I leave you alone for now. Thanks a lot. But you'll allow me not to fall at your feet. If you do happen to find Javed, I'll be glad to hear about it. And if you find any of his underlings, I wouldn't mind having a chat with them, too. You know what's actually really strange about this whole situation is I tend to believe Ramsmeat the most. <laughs> Need to speak with Raymond. Raymond is the, uh, that's the, uh, detective, isn't it? Yeah, detective. As if. Nothing like mugging. Mugging? Beat a man. Take whatever you can I have say. totally forgotten about him. He's right here, actually, in this scene. He's right there on the left, right in that house. I just have to get back over there. I've never been really good at these open-ended oh, mysteries. If all the evidence is circumstantial, I, I tend to... Uh, to like seize up myself, like no confidence in my decisions type deal. Oh, life! Hmm. I saw an assassin there for a second. Raymond, what's going on, bro? Whoa, that is a big dinner. You seem very hungry, sir. I'm all ears, White Wolf. Hmm. So, I got to the prisoner. He spill anything? Didn't have time. Ramsmeat's men attacked. You sure? Strange. Ramsmeat wants Salamandra gone, unless something I don't know about has occurred. Javed might have scared him, or paid him off. Something to check. Did you get anything out of the prisoner? One word. Kalkstein. Makes sense. Kalkstein's known to be a talented alchemist. He could be helping Javed with his experiments. I've met Kalkstein. He didn't look the criminal. That might be true, but we need to check all our leads. Let's get to work. I'll ask around town, talk to my contacts. You keep an eye on Kalkstein. Gain his trust. Get to know his plans and secrets. How do you want to proceed? Patience. This is just like fishing. I prefer hunting. Then gain Kalkstein's trust. Do him a favor. Learn something that interests him. You could get him to hire you. And talk to Ramsmeat, but don't overdo it. There's one with a short temper. I got another thing to ask you. I'm all ears, White Wolf. So, I questioned the captain of the city guard. Any conclusions? I don't have enough facts. That, Witcher, is what investigations are about. Getting the facts. Ask around about Vincent and Salamandra. Talk to anyone you can link to our suspect. Find a promising lead. Ask the suspect about it. His reaction will speak volumes. Once you have a clear picture, confront him. In the meantime, follow through on all the other leads, no matter how insignificant they might seem. Hmm. See you soon. Okay. Hmm, mere deduction. Alright, I think I've already gotten Kalkstein to hire me, because that's about gaining the ten doohickeys of the place, and... It's time to talk to Raymond and decide how to use his trust. Yeah, that's what I thought. Ah, that's something else. Oh, so it wants me to talk to Raymond again. Hold on. You're dead. <laughs> You will die. 
You're in deep shit. Thanks, Geralt. You saved my life. The bastards snuck in here. Somehow they found out I'm after them. Who? What happened? Salamandra. I was a step away from solving the mystery. One small step. Relax, Raymond. You're safe now. Not likely. They're following me day and night. I gotta find a way to lose them. What do we do? I'll set a false trail. You question the new suspects. Who? Here, take these notes. They list all the key leads. What do you intend to do? They're on my heels, so I've got to disappear. I'll draw them away while you pursue the investigation. I'll find you, White Wolf. Hmm. Merchant Lou Varden. That must be that dude's head. Huh. Oops. We have more suspects. Lou Varden. Zeman Confidential. We need to talk to the merchant Lou Varden. Okay. Where's this guy? Gate to the Dyke. Interesting. Why would he be there? He's a merchant. Maybe he's a traveling merchant. Hey, Siegfried is over here. What's up, man? Geralt! Good to see you. Where are you going? To the dike. No passage. Captain forbids it. Why? Captain's orders. Talk to him. Gentlemen, that's no way to treat a hero. Geralt, the witcher that saved Vizima from a terrible cockatrice. A hero? Well, that changes things. He's almost one of us. In that case, please pass, Master Geralt. We'll drink your health at the inn. Thanks, Siegfried. Excellent. A surprise in the sewers. A night of the flaming rose, soaked in stench from head to foot. I usually work alone, but this was an opportunity to see a knight in action. I must say he did rather well for a human. That was rare gratitude he showed. So now I can freely go to the dike, but I probably want to wait until daytime so that I can see if uh, Luvarden is going to be at that door rather than on the other side of the door, you know what I mean? Because I think, well, I mean, merchants are normally only going to work during the day, right? So let's crash for a minute. Man, I'm about to level again. This is awesome. All right, let's wait until dawn, plus an hour. Uh, oh, yeah, that. <laughs> plus, I should be healed in that amount of time. I guess that's another benefit of uh, resting I never thought of. You're not working with them, are you? Nice to see you. Hmm. See ya. What's his name said? Do I look like a whore to you? I don't know if he was insinuating something or that he was just. Oh, wait. Never mind. He followed that up with, Are you trying to fuck me? Society made me. Way to be pleasant about it, man. Well, maybe the dude is actually on the other side of the gate. I guess we'll find out, shall we? Ah, yes, it's still indicating for me to go out further. The dike. Hell. If 
ferryman. See, someone said that these aren't necessary to actually skin with. So I'd rather carry a torch, honestly. Declan! Are you coming to me? Army life's tough. You again? They let you into town? Are you Luvarden? I am. Let's talk. Yes? I buried your friend. Ah, sad to end up in some forgotten village. It was a decent burial. He got his own sarcophagus. Well, I thank you. Wholeheartedly. Forgetting something? All right. Your 200 orns. Thank you. Yes? Hmm. Uh, yeah, let's ask him that. I seek the Sephiroth stones. I haven't yet located them all. I thought you might know such art and oddities. I once purchased one for its magical potential, which turned out false. And I paid a mage a costly sum for the examination. Then would you sell it to me? Sell my Tiparath? <laughs> I'm rather fond of it. I'll give you a good price. Five hundred orms? I didn't think it was worth so much. But all right. I wear Tiparath as an amulet. We can deal right now. Uh... Crap. I have 500 orans, though it's quite a price to pay for a stone. I sadly relinquish it, but my reputation would suffer, as would my business, if I did not deal. The Sephira is yours. Ouch. Interesting. Yes? All right, so we're not done yet. I heard creatures threaten the transport of goods. Yes, uh, I assume you're not asking for curiosity's sake. I'm hoping someone will pay for their removal. I may. The dog by the swamp is crucial to my business. The creatures have caused me losses. What are the beasts like? Drowners. They emerge at night, destroying goods and murdering carriers. I'll pay 400 orns to be rid of them. Ah, yeah, sure, no problem. A pleasure doing business. Indeed. Farewell. Let me collect my money before I accuse him of something. Who wishes to cross? Okay. So a lot of people are going to be asking... Well, if people told you that most of this food is useless, why do you keep picking it up? And my response to that is, it's easy money. I'll pick it up until I can't pick it up any longer, and then I'll sell it all. Will you get out of my way, dog? Be alert. I'll sell it all, and Damn, make good. a decent amount off of it. This is, okay, yeah, this is pretty straightforward so far. This appears to be all of it, actually. Well, there's a little over here. Hmm. Let's rest here. I'll wait until nighttime, fight the drowners. Can I make some potions? Negative. What about leveling? I don't. No, nothing to that. Alright. Because why just rest if you Hell. can do stuff while you rest, right? Alright, drowners. Whoop. Where are you? Army life's tough. Well, he doesn't want to get into the water, that's for sure. Maybe they're over there. They're not appearing here. Pardon me, fellas. Be alert! Be 
Eternal fire, fill me. Old Vizima, beyond that gate, the Catriona Plague kills dozens every day. I have a feeling the quarantine's useless. What's hmm. this? Can I get in there? Oh, that's old Vizima. So they're just talking about... Well, he said they're by the docks. These are the docks, right? Army life's tough. Hmm. I'm gonna wait a little bit longer, and then if that doesn't pass, I'll go into old Vizima. Let's wait until midnight, see if that has any effect on them. Ah, yes, here we go. I need to collect a particular remain off of them. Or remain. Or a particular drop. Let's go over to the other side. Maybe there's just an X number I have to deal with. Drowners. What's the deal, fellas? Drown dead tongues. This, okay. Seven more Sephiroth. Okay, so I still need Luvarden. Alright, so first things first. Let's talk to him. And then I'll head over into Old Vizima. See what's going on over there. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> Scared the crap out of me standing right behind me like that. Damn, I'm thirsty. Declan. Army life's tough. Bro. Yes? Hmm. I suspect you know about Salamandra. I know nothing. We'll see. Can I return to my business? We need to talk about your dealings with Salamandra. You paid to have the professor released. <laughs> Why would I bother with a criminal? Why not? Would I do it so clumsily as to implicate myself? Possibly. I suppose not. I don't have any definitive proof, so I'll let it lie, for now. Wise choice. You should trust your instincts more. Hmm. Yes? The dock has yet to be cleared of drowners. I won't interfere with your methods, but remember, my time is valuable. I'll visit the swamp as soon as possible. Yes? Okay. 
So this is not the swamp, apparently. Let's sell... That stuff. Just to get rid of it. Cause I don't want to carry it around with me. Uh, okay. Now let's head into Old Vizima. That would never happen back home in Redania. Good. Mom. Eternal fire, fill my heart! In the war, I served under Bronibor in the PFI. Halt. No passage through here. Keep your shirt on. Can I ask why? Not even the Emperor of Nilfgaard can pass. Captain's orders. Why wouldn't you let the Emperor pass? Those are my orders. Now I see why we won the war. <laughs> Damn. So I need to talk to this... Can I get her? Captain guy. Pretty screwy country. I can't do either of those. Press four. Yeah, see, it says press four to select one or four to select that. I was hoping this had pressed something to select this, Damn but it doesn't. Maria. Neither do these, though. Hmm. Oh well. Hopefully, Who's I'll figure this? that out eventually. A harbor whore. Excellent. Hey, what about this ferryman? I never talked to him. God, Hello, grant me patience. Ferryman. Wait. Army life's tough. Do not depart. Transport services at the best prices. Where are you going? Where do you go? I ferry people from Vizima to the swamp and back. Ah. Take me to the other side. Times are wasting. Made up your mind. Indeed. Five horns? Ready to go? Yeah. How many times are you going to ask me that? To the swamp. Swamp Forest. Excellent. I should probably save. It's been a while since I've saved. Although I know autosave is frequent. Oh, this looks pleasant. Lovely. Okay. Anyone seeking Vapors, to cross? Papers, drowners, and wet feet. That's all I'll find here. What's up, Jean Pierre? Who are you? A Witcher. Well, well. I thought Leo Bonhart had disposed of your kind. Never heard of him. Nor will you again. We all, in this profession, eventually meet someone better than us. What profession is that? Bounty hunter. What brings you here? Interesting. I'm here about the notice. Finally. Got the hides? I'll return when I have the pelts. I'll be here. Pelts for what now? <laughs> I don't even remember. Who was Bonhart? Old Leo was a legend. In some ways, he was like you. He killed without emotion. Just like you would kill a... a lame drowner. He was the best. Tall, slim, and... One gaze from those empty eyes could break a man. Was he a mage? No. He slew some witchers. Those who riled the peasants. Magic tricks and witchers' reflexes proved useless against him. But he's dead. As they say, he hit a harder rock than he was himself. Yes. Take care, Witcher. Farewell. So I am to get... pelts for you, apparently, aren't I? Uh, what's this? Primary, secondary... 
See, these are suspects. Suspects. All ghoul contact. Marrow. Drowned dead. The tongues. Echinopse. Roots. Wolves. Ah. Wolf pelts. Okay. I should do some of these side contracts first. Let's, uh... That's all. Okay, let's do this. Side stuff first. Okay. Well, I can't track the wolf contact contract or any of the others, but they're probably all going to be here. Well, I don't want to go back, so there's no use talking to him. Celandine. White Myrtle. Oh, nothing beats meat. Gross. Lots of brick mayors over there. Brick makers. Mayors? Hello, son. I'm not your son, Gramps. <laughs> you guess my name. They call me Gramps around here. They call me all kinds of things. Mostly Geralt. Or scabbed freak. Well, people exaggerate. I don't see many scabs. <laughs> no offense. None taken. But I'm likely to earn some trekking through this swamp. Yes? I'm looking for work. Ah, swords. I suspect I know the type of work you seek. Perhaps you could escort me to the chapel for my prayers. I'm old and no longer good at driving monsters off with my staff. Uh... Well, yeah, sure, but you're probably going to get killed along the way. I'm pretty sure of it. Sorry. I was thinking about paying work, but all right, I'll take you there. Lead the way. What was that? Where, where's the shrine? Oh, crap. <laughs> it's so far. I think he's doing a decent job of following me. Alright, drowners. Enough! I've had enough! Enough! I've had enough! Greetings. Fight me. Jerk. There's a lot of you here, actually. You coming for some? Enough! I've had enough! Clay pits. This is where those lunatics work. Huh. They look normal to me. <laughs> Brickmakers pretend to be normal to strangers, yet they conceal their faith. Do you know those dimwits worship fish people? People believe in the strangest things. Yeah, but to worship slime-covered reptiles with bulging eyes. I, those Vodianoi can't even talk. You must communicate with them using objects. Care to elaborate? Humans communicate with fishoids by leaving objects on special altars. Each item has specific symbolic meaning and is read as an intention. The Vodianoi answer in the same manner. What kind of objects? Don't know, and I don't care. You need to speak with one of the worshippers. But brickmakers don't divulge their knowledge to potential blasphemers. Hmm. Interesting. The 
These boggy holes must be clay pits. Indeed. Although I don't think these, uh... Fool's Parsley? Alright, sure, why not? I've never had any before, so it can't hurt to pick some up. Am I supposed to be killing drowners, or what? Drowned dead. That's different, apparently. Okay. Well, let's... Let's clear out some of these drowners anyway. Hello? Come here. Enough! Come on, enough! Enough! Come on, enough! Enough! How about enough? Pull out the right sword, dang it! Here we go. Jesus. <laughs> oh, that was horrible. If these had been difficult enemies, I would have so been dead. The monsters have torn a lot of flesh from the corpse. It's obvious the mortal wounds were afflicted by a sword. A sharp one at that. Another salamandra. So I could care less who killed them. They just needed to die regardless. Alright, so... Let's get some more of this white myrtle. Well, I'm right here anyway. Hellbore. Enough. What the enough. hell is that? Oh god. I'm dying. Well, crap. That thing is beefy.